Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 31 of Tropical Rouge Pretty Hair. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, this is the, yeah, this is the Oscar focus episode that we were talking about last week. So then why in the world didn't Mirodin go? Good at it? Oh my... <laughs> Girls, what the heck? Laura! Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, you know what? It makes sense. <laughs> but Laura should have been like, hey, by the way, everybody else is coming, too. They're currently on their way now. <laughs> But dang, four minutes in. Oh. Yeah. Easiest way to get motivation. Oh. <laughs> 
She would be eating at a time like this. But you can't do everything by yourself, though. I feel like this is very similar to a Pokemon battle. <laughs> It's fine, everybody's eating. Besides, it looks like you need to talk to someone. You say that. Let's go. Mm hmm You were on a team together. And unfortunately, Oh, that's bull.
That's so unfair. I get it, but still. That's good. And after that, she's just been a total loner. And I get that. Sometimes you just need to be on your own. <laughs> My poor babies, they were running almost all dang day. <laughs> that and you were still so freaking hard headed let her do this finally something on these two freaking agree on Jesus
Oh, she fell in love right then and there. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh, she figured it out. Come on now. Now, but the question is, is Yuriko going to confront Asuka on that? I mean... You know, since you guys are here, So, yeah, what's going to happen with Laura and the rest of the girls about this situation? (laughs) 
Yeah, but you would have gotten in trouble. And we don't need that. She needs that pillow. It's a nice job. <laughs> hey, but you needed it though. <laughs> That's our no bar, you know? <laughs> Just make her in a stuffed plushie for a day. <laughs> really nice, poor baby. <laughs> Honestly, to finally get the answer that we have been wanting slash waiting for for the longest time. Like, oh my god, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Domo, arigato, gozaimashita. Because, like, oh my god, I had been waiting for, like, an episode on this still explaining, like, yeah, why these two don't really talk to each other anymore and what their relationship was like in the first place with them and I mean to see it and the fact is that you know they had to withdraw from that situation because of course we all saw right there that of course those two girls were trying to take Yuriko's racket destroy it so she wouldn't be able to play. And of course, Asuka did the right thing to stop them and such. Because of course, that's what you're supposed, you're supposed to do for a teammate. When something happens, you go in there and be like, what you doing? <laughs> like straight up, like hold up, no, 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 no. Mm -mm. But I hate the fact that not only did Yuriko, Asuka, and the rest of their school had to withdraw, but also the other team. But in my opinion, it should have just been the other team. If there was a little more, like, if people did come up and say something, yeah, Asuka wouldn't have been alone for that long of a time. And I get it, because sometimes in the end, yeah, you don't always really need teammates. Sometimes you just need yourself at the end of the day. But at the same time, this also learned Asuka saying, like, yeah, you need help sometimes. You can't always do everything on your own. You have to have people around you for a reason so that you know whenever you do fall you can lean on them no oh, so i'm going to do fine are those outfits probably going to give me inspiration probably yes yes you never know but seriously i'm loving these freaking episodes that focus on each and every single one of these girls every single week is like oh my god going back into in, into any other season and trying to give everyone equal amount of focus it is hard but i love the fact that they're doing it in a right way i'm not gonna say that it's also because of my damn videos of me saying ish um i feel like it's also people who are sitting watching voicing their opinions on the internet and stuff because come on now Everyone gets their freaking opinions from the freaking internet <laughs> in a nutshell. But, I mean, yes, this was a really, truly, like, honest to God, very nice, interesting episode about Asuka and her situation. Hell, I, I mean, all this to give her her pillow back, I understand, because, of course, she's not going to sleep on any other pillow. It, it's like when you have a certain pillow or a certain blanket or something that is of yours, and when someone says, well, hey, you can use this of mine or whatever, it's not the same. I, I so understand that and such. And I'm like, yeah, I can't always use everybody's stuff because it's like my thing is precious to me. And I'm like, nah, bro. Like, it it don't work like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> but other than that, guys, this is my reaction view towards episode 31 of Tropical Rouge Pretty Care. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the National Squad, and of course, I will see you all officially next Saturday or Sunday for episode 32. Bye, guys.